Hello, my name is Leo Galbraith and I go to Oak Bay High School. For the last couple of weeks, my teacher, Ms. Watson, has been showing us some of First Nations culture. In this visual audio presentation, I prepared a few poems that I'd like to share. My first poem is a free verse poem about the raven. Black as night and bold as day, with glistening eye and lustrous feather, he guards the tribe from ancient time, fierce hunter, sleek stalker. From stark naked trees, he guides the people through winter's dark sky. Powerful trickster and playful companion, his caw joins the clan during summer's delights. Here in line 8, I use personification to paint a clearer picture. In line 1 and 2, I use simile to describe the raven. My second poem is a lyric poem. The hunters gather at the break of dawn, and hoping today I'll pursue a fawn. Upon my horse I can see the horizon. I'm proud to be here. I will not wizen. Here on this day I will prove my mettle. Surely my stomach will soon enough settle. The clan will commend me for my hunter's prowess. Night cannot come soon enough, I must confess. Enough hesitation, take heart, seize the day. Courage and tenacity deliver my prey. Since this is a lyric poem, I have rhyme scheme scattered throughout. These are my haikus about the grandfather teachings. I chose love and respect. Love, love's not wrong, or powerful, or rhythm. It's breathe in, breathe out. Respect. Respect is given to those who don't neglect the world. The world is our home. My first poem, Love, is a metaphor, saying that love cannot be defined. In my second poem, Respect, I use the last sentence to create a more meaningful picture. Next, I have my concrete poem. The theme of this poem is nature. Little cloud dances across the sky, happily following its white brothers and sisters towards the horizon. Mother sun smiles delightedly upon the cheerful tribe. Father wind comes, first whispering blusterly soon raging and howling, violently roaring, tugging and tearing, until the little cloud cries. Rain falls upon the earth. In this poem, I have sprinkled personification throughout. Two good examples of this are in line 4 and 7. I also used hyperbole to set strong emotion in line 7. This is my acronym poem about the word nation. The theme of this poem is within a nation. National pride, acceptance of one of each other, treasuries of hope, internal destruction, old glory, never resting. In every second line of this poem, I try to use wordplay to create a negative edge to a seemingly positive poem. Okay, so that's all my poems. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope you enjoyed listening to all my poems. I also wanted to give a special shout-out to a few people who really helped me with this project, especially Starla Anderson, Alex Nelson, uh, Ms. Watson, and Mr. McKenzie, and a lot of other people. Uh, it was a really fun project. I had a good time, and I really hope you enjoyed my poems. And I'm Leo Galbraith. Thank you again so much for watching.